This is an Ellis Mowers and More product review. Interested in buying this product? The link is in the description below. Have a product inquiry or a home, garden, or automotive product or tool to review? Email me, ellis at ellismowers.com, or reach out on Instagram and Facebook at Ellis Mowers and More. And as always, like and subscribe for more product reviews and small engine content. On today's product review, we're going to look at this product from Kobezi. This is a 10 by 30 pop-up canopy tent. If you need to shade a lot of people or house a lot of people under some shelter or a canopy, this thing right here will do it, and it will do it about as easy as you're going to be able to do it. Saves a lot of time when it comes to not having to put a bunch of poles together. Just got this fold-out tent frame like you see in a standard tent canopy. It's just a really large one. So uh, it's uh, going to be, uh, like I said, a really large tent. We're going to get this thing out and uh, open it up see what's all inside, look at some of the features of it, and then just give you a little bit of a demonstration of it. So let's go ahead and get started. So there we go, it took about a little over 10 minutes to get to this point with two people. Um, you just have to literally just unfold it, put it all, uh, lock all the legs in, put the canopy on. You can keep the canopy on now uh, whenever you fold it, uh, just to make it a little bit easier to set up. And uh, yeah, and then you just lock these uh, little pieces down right here. You clip everything up at the top, and then there's a couple of Velcro items underneath them as well as we go in here. You'll Velcro all of these to the, um, to the frame, and then you can see the frame inside is kind of all-encompassing in itself. There's no pulse or anything that you have to put in. It's all one big frame. The frame is probably the medium duty frame. Uh, it would, it's going to work just fine and the advantage of this type of frame is that it's a little bit lighter than the heavy duty frame that you sometimes find on these canopies. The tent material, the canopy material looks to be pretty good overall um, and is providing a decent amount of shade as you can see. Uh, the area that it is covering even in this shaded area back here in my backyard so um, 30 feet long huge tent guys huge tent I'll do my best to give you all an idea of how much room there is in this tent to put things here in a second but what we're gonna do next is throw the panels on and the only thing with the panels is they are fully velcro they so they literally just velcro to the top of the tent and it's really nice to just be able to put them on that easily so what we're going to do is do that um, we'll put them uh, along the side we'll leave openings on the end so i can show you what all you can put underneath this tent you can use it just like this again there are multiple different height levels of this tent so we have it at the lowest right now, but you can go up even higher as you can see right there. So multiple different levels that you can take this. And uh, like I said, really good, you know, easy to put up considering how large it is, good construction overall, and gives you a ton of shade for whatever event that you are hosting or whatever shelter you want to cover. All right, so we put the sides on it again. And just to give you a demonstration of what all you can fit underneath this pretty comfortably. For the sides, it's literally just you Velcro it all the way across. 
and then all the way down a couple of velcros right there and you do that for all the panels there are five panels that have windows and there are three that do not so we did three on one side with the windows two on the other and then one that has the zip up panel right there you just zip it up and kind of curl it up and uh, you can access the tent but then still have the full enclosure and then I'll show you all in a second you can put the panels on each end and have a fully enclosed tent canopy for privacy and or protection from the elements just to give you an idea of how big this 10 by 30 is I uh, fit a full-size golf cart with a dump bed in here and then a utility vehicle with a dump bed in here and we still got about three feet on that end and then when we come back here we will have a couple of chairs as you can see in front of it so that you can sit nice and comfortably in it so just to give you an idea of space again you can put a bunch of chairs in here good amount of chairs uh, if you want to eat have a few tables in here just you know a lot of different possibilities for a tent of this size again 30 feet long so you could even fit um, a vehicle or two in here if you decided you wanted to for what it is so I'm gonna get all the panels on it just to show you what it looks like from the outside and the inside fully enclosed and then we'll tear everything down and finish everything up all right guys here's what it looks like with all the panels on it um, again it looks similar from the inside just like I showed you a little bit earlier there's a lot of space in there for you to do whatever activities that you want to do um, again the panels overall are pretty good they velcro to the sides and so the only thing they're gonna act is if you have this in a big open area it's gonna act as a big wind sweep but that's where the sandbags that come with it and the stakes that come with it come into play overall I think the frame will be able to handle everything uh, as long as you don't hang a bunch of weight and stuff off of the frame like lights and stuff or de decorations and whatnot um, if it's a calm day it'll be just fine but just keep in mind if it's breezy uh, the more weight you have the uh, the easier that it would be for that frame to get compromised but overall this looks really good again we can I'll show you all what it looks like whenever we zip up these solid panels right here and tie them up so that you can have access but still can get it fully enclosed if you desire so there's what it looks like guys with the solid panels unzipped and kind of folded out it provides you access to get into the tent but still the ease of being able to pull these back down and zip it up if you need that privacy um, from the elements or if you're protecting yourself from the elements as well um, overall the way that this is constructed as well it uh, should keep all the water outside of those panels if it does rain because of the way that these panels uh, velcro in all the rain water should go outside of them you should be able to stay dry and uh, again protected from the elements All right. y'all just saw we got it all back in this bag right here so it's ready to go just want to keep in mind this bag is it's a tight fit I will say that much the zipper already tried to bend a little bit whenever I put it back in and overall it just feels like this is kind of like a point where it's gonna potentially rip so 
what I would recommend doing is be a two-person carry um, and so that you're not putting all the weight on the strap just carry it from the bottom there and then also I don't know if I'd put the windows back in the bag just kind of carry them separately if you're gonna carry them but you can get them all back in this bag which is a plus just be very careful with that zipper because the zipper is not the best however everything else about the construction of the tent and the tent itself is just fine so guys that is everything on this Kobezi 10 by 30 tent canopy it uh again overall for the size it is fairly easy to put up if you have two people if you have a couple more people than two people that is even more ideal but i'd say two people as the minimum quality of construction overall seems to be pretty good the canopy is uh got a lot of UV protection because I can't see a lot of sunlight through it and then these windows here they have a little bit of fabric runs and whatnot but uh, they're you know very adequate for what you would be needing it for you can use it in any aspect any you got multiple different heights you can use this on as well and uh, for multiple different uses it could house some machines you could use it for an event space you could use it for a storage space as long as you don't have it in a big open and windy area it does have some sandbags that go with it if you uh, need to secure it more with that as well as some stakes so you have a, a few options there as well so again overall these tent canopies are awesome um, especially if you're having an event or something as opposed to having to rent one you could buy one like this and be able to use it repeatedly and be able to set it up yourself so thanks again for watching this product review hopefully you found it helpful and i will catch y'all on the next one